don't worry, anglers. It won't be long before you can head out in the fishing boat. I've actually seen some on the Fox already. And there's an event at Shopco Hall this weekend to get you ready for all that. We've got Dan uh, Lobenstein, who joins us from the Northeast Wisconsin Sport Fishing Show this morning. Hi, Dan. Good morning, Dan. Good Good morning. Happy uh, Sunday. Indeed. You know, spring is nearly Indeed. here, and uh, young man's thoughts turn lightly to love or fishing. <laughs> In the long run, fishing is probably less expensive. <laughs> <laughs> I'd agree with you that way. So it sounds like you are the place for fishing today. What do you have going on out there? That's right. Well, this is a 26 year for our fishing show here, and it showcases everything for the angler from little tiny 30 second ounce jigs to hand painted, hand carved <laughs> custom musky baits and uh, up to bass boats. So anything that could uh, possibly fit into your fishing plans for this year is right here at Shopco Hall till 5 o'clock tonight. What do you find that a lot of people are looking for when they head out to the fishing show? Well, you know, the technology changes every year. There's new types of electronics available, new baits uh, emerge that uh, are more productive, perhaps, than previous uh, baits. And, well, at least they're more productive in uh, attracting the fishermen, and that counts for our exhibitors. <laughs> <laughs> How funny. And why this time of year? Why? Does, isn't it a little early yet? Well, it is uh, just on the cusp of open water fishing, and this is a perfect cure for cabin fever. We've all been cooped up, uh, whether it's inside or in, a, in an ice shack, uh, it's time to get outside, and this is just a way to look forward to that season that's just around the corner. Well, with the weather we're having right now, with the sunshine that's out, I think people are just biting at the, at the bit to get out there and uh, start to snag their own favorite fish. Uh, well, in terms of uh, technology, you said things have changed. Uh, with the lures, is there anything really new and hot that's going on this time in lures? Well, there's a new technique that's, uh, it's not a new technique, it's an old technique that's being applied in a new fashion. It's uh, trolling spoons for walleyes, and that's one of our seminars today. Um, it's a real productive method for taking walleyes on the larger bodies of water, particularly like Green Bay, Beta Knock, um, places like that. And uh, the, the technology in the electronics is where it's like a computer. Every year it changes, it gets better, and it's less expensive. Hmm. Less expensive. I like that. Yeah, a lot of people like that. So you're out at Chopco Hall today uh, from 10 to 5, right? That is correct. Admissions only $8. The kids under 12 are free. And there's a trout pond stocked with hungry rainbow trout, which is a place where a lot of kids catch their very first fish. So bring them on out. There you go. That would be a lot of fun. Hey, thanks for joining us thanks, this morning. Thanks, Dan. Thank you very much. You bet.